Okay, hi guys. So, how's everybody going right about now? <laughs> There's a lot that I could tell you, but um, I think really for now, everything that I've got to say, I said about this time. I think I've said already. So, um, really, if you're confused about what you should be doing right now, I would say just go to my old videos. But I will say everything is going perfectly, beautifully, better than I could even imagine. Now, I will say one thing to um, everybody in this. We'll, we'll see who... Well, the people that you... Sorry. The people that uh, are meant to understand it will understand it. Okay. So... As the vibration raises, and it's raising very, very fast, <laughs> sorry about that, it's raising very, very fast, then people will have to decide, like I've told you, they'll have to decide whether or not they're going to raise in vibrations or not. Uh, if they do not, there is no harm nor foul on this. I've told you guys this over and over again. But Gaia is raising. The consciousnesses that are in... Prefer, mostly humans, and really nobody else is doing this on the planet, just humans, if there are consciousness in the bodies, the human bodies, and they don't want to raise, uh, nobody's in trouble for that. That's not a bad thing. If they want to continue to play the uh, gecko game for now and soon the pigeon game, then they have the right to do that, okay? But it can't be on this earth, this original earth. So what happens is there are alternate Earths that continue the games that those people want to play. And everybody who agrees with that will end up on those Earths. No big deal. Now what happens is the, the majority of their consciousness will leave the bodies that are on this Earth and they will become very what I call flat affect or robotic in nature. Uh, they just don't have the personality that they used to. Now, some people were robotic anyway as geckos, followers, so you might not see a big change in them unless you knew them well. But um, that's okay. That's okay. They'll leave enough so that it doesn't look like, number one, uh, millions of people are dropping off the planet every day, which would be scary, and it would throw everybody else into fear, which would just essentially wipe all of the humans off to an alternate planet, which is not what it's not what anybody wants to do and number two it would kill off all of the physical human bodies which Gaia doesn't really want to do now I've been worried about this for a while you know what happens to the NPCs over time I mean do we have to wait till the prisms grow up to rule the world uh, is that how it works or do we just have to wait till enough of them are on the planet that the rest of us just raise with them I mean how's this going to work and are the human bodies that will not raise, then there's bi billions of them, um, are they going to all have to die and be replaced? Um, how is that going to work? Well, I just found out that no, that's not how it's going to work. That when enough of the people that want to stay in a lower vibration leave and change in NPC status, then the, the planet will rise because that's 90% of low energy for each and every powerful human that will be off the planet, right? So, um, that changes a lot of energy. Now there's enough room for the prism energy to really expand, even though they're young, right? Okay, so now everything raises. At a certain point, once we get to a certain point, the entities that are outside the game that want to play in duality and they want to play in linear, but they didn't want to go as low as what planet Earth was, so they're kind of waiting in line for the ride, but they're waiting for a certain ride, not that ride, they want this ride, then they're going to come in, and they're going to come to the NPC's consciousness. Now, that's on a higher level. It's not going to happen down here. You're not going to see it. But these entities are going to come into these consciousness that are 10 percent here, the NPCs, and they're going to say, hey, I'll take over that body if you want me to. Now, some of them will say, no, I want to stay with my 10 percent, 
see how this finishes and they'll gradually lose percentage on this planet until their body does die or a walk-in takes over on the other hand a good majority of them over rather, relatively short period of time are going to accept these other entity walk-in deals and the walk-in is going to come in as a much higher entity they're not going to have that low energy they're going to come in at that that level that high-end level they will come in at the top level that they can the majority of them the 10 percent will leave and that percentage of consciousness will go to the alternate planet that they scooted off to when they became NPCs and that will leave a walk-in new entity at a very high um, vibration which will essentially means that all of these NPCs don't have to die and we don't have to wait uh, for the prisms to grow up that means that on these timelines this is going to happen much much faster okay this is excellent surprising superb news guys everybody should get up and jump up and down now al along the way there is always going to be the geckos trying to get you down in fear and anger and um, we're going into pigeon land now hardcore so the pigeons are really working at that judgment game right now it's not even so much the geckos I see I see judgment um, judgment everywhere so you know watch that I, it's a little bit trickier to get yourself out of judgment than it is fear and anger fear and anger is pretty easy to identify judgment could sneak up on you guys now fear and anger was also worry so I had to talk you out of that the worry is anger so you've done a pretty good job of that but now everybody's really deeply into judgment and it's tricky it is very tricky it's how you ask the question if you ask the question should I turn right or left with a, with an openness of not caring that is not judgment that is just simply making a decision okay okay well this way I've got to go this way and this way I've got to go this way uh, judgment is it has an emotional attachment to it and the pigeon judgment will con will absolutely convince you that your set of ideals your belief system that made you choose that right or left is the right way and yours is better trick here is always remember this is a game uh, let everybody play out their game but play your game remember play your game whatever you focus on that's what you're giving power to whatever you focus on you are a part of so if you are watching stuff about the riots and choosing a side I don't care which side you want protester or riots then you are giving it energy if you focus on the fact that people are understanding that they need to be self-sufficient more self-reliant that they need to communicate better that they don't need as much as they thought they need if you give if you notice that it gives that power so be very careful what you watch be very careful what you give energy to all right okay then so that's it uh, I think the next video I'm going to uh, start something different so uh, yeah we'll see when I do that I love you guys so much you guys are doing super great um, don't worry about it you can't get it wrong uh, don't don't judge yourself either okay don't judge yourself either you have got a higher self that knows what's going on you can't get it wrong so just try to relax a little bit okay all right guys I love you so much and I'll see you later bye now